Welcome to RagInfo.com. In this video, I will explain you about how to create a child project inside Agile Center or Rally. So, if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Let's understand today's agenda, then we will move forward with the practical example. I will explain here how to create child project, edit child project, update child project details. So let's do that practically. So first of all, what is child project? So if you can see here, there are several projects are available here, which is a parent one. If I want to create one child project here, then I need to add a small project inside this project because in organization, it might be happen that one project is big one and there are several other models are available. So that perspective, the organization are creating or managing their different projects because of the ease of use as well as tracking purpose. So if you jump to workspace project where you can see these are the parent project available here. If I want to create any specific child project inside the demo project, just sign it to create. Click on here, provide the detail of project. So, child project, description of the child project, which are all components we are going to build here, what all functionality should be there, we need to add it to here. So, this is the description page. I am not including anything. But it's always required or mandate to include each and everything in detail what we are going to cover, which will give a clear idea for others what we are implementing in this project. Description here. Then, if you want to keep the open or close as per your needs, you can create it. If you want to copy the time box of your parent project you can otherwise uncheck it if you want to copy the milestone of parent project you can keep it copy users if you want to keep same users here as well then it's okay page sharing so if you have any custom page created you can include it if you have any additional notes kindly use or use this field so auto state update so whatever field you have selected, if anything is updated in parent, that should be reflected here as well. So that is auto update. Once entering all the details are completed, select save and close. Now refresh this and you are, see, you are able to see this project is created. Select the child project. If you want to add iterations, releases. Same type of parameters is available like in your parent projects. You can add the users, releases, iterations inside that as well. You can also create a child run project. Revision history, these all information are exactly the same. So if you don't know about how to create a parent project, I will also include the URL in description tab which is I already covered so you can watch it then you will refer it this video so that's all about creating a child project hope you like it if you really enjoyed this session consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates thank you for watching